Yo, what is going on everybody? It is Tristan and today in this video what I got going on for you guys is something short and simple. We're discussing a dunk low that's going to be restocking tomorrow and we're actually going to be going over the needlework dunk low. That is the pair that we're going to be discussing that is restocking. So just want to kind of bring it to y'all what I think um, about this restock. Probably, you know, the amount of pairs we'll have like realistically what type of release this will be. And yeah, we'll get into it from there. So if you want more content like this, check my Instagrams, any of that down below. And of course, my friend and I's group, the daily under market deals we drop for members every week, teaching you how to bot. We've had people hitting like 10 plus and confirmed this morning for so, uh, some pairs. So again, if you're trying to learn how to bot, just have more success in general. You don't even have to buy even if people do it for you. Anything along those lines, just let me know. And yeah, we can totally help you out. So I hope to see you all there. And again, you can see everything that is offered on our site. Here you all are. And you can see all that. Again, the early info and releases, like pings, stock numbers for drops, free and paid ACO. So again, botters that can run for you, teach you how to run for free. And we have an autofill tool coming soon. Of course, our profitable backdoors and one on one support. So stop sleeping, become a better reseller. And you can see our testimonials and even some of the success we have. And of course, I just showed you all some. That's from the first 10 days of May. So yeah, don't sleep. And feel free to get in the wait list right here so you can start cooking more with us know about these drops in advance shock drops in-store information so you can you know go to your local stores anything along those lines so i hope to see you all there and let's get started so and we got under market sb4s on the way this week some lobsters coming soon so yeah don't miss out but First things first, as you guys can see, this is going to be dropping June 1st at 11 a.m. Eastern time. Now, I know some people are asking me, and I've already gotten some DMs about this um, on Discord. If you know people in the group that have been asking, hey, uh, usually Nike just drops at 10 a.m. Why are these at 11 a.m.? And I kind of want to explain why. So the main reason for this would be that Nike has a lot of uh, a lot of drops coming on June 1st at 10 a.m. We got the Tiana Taylors, and I know there's a couple other dunk restocks, just you know, my people that flip locally, and maybe for some people that are interested uh, in them there. So there's going to be a lot of restocks on June 1st at 10 a.m. Eastern time, and also, you know, some regular releases. So we have to keep that in mind, and that's why these ones have been pushed back an hour to 11 a.m. is because it isn't the main restock that is being focused on that day, or even the main thing that day. We got an actual sneaker drop, or an actual sneaker drop scheduled which is the Tiana Taylors, which again, I just want to say, people are sleeping on those. I know the design is not what everybody is thinking. They definitely do look like some Ronald McDonald ones, but I, I just want to say this right here. It's not one that you should ignore. And the main reason for that is because look at the prices now. And also, again, the name that you're using, that's a very big name in a sneaker, Tiana Taylor. So you just have to think about those kinds of factors. And you're like, all right, this is not the type of sneaker that would fail. Because I already know people in New York are just going to be going crazy for this pair because that's where she's from, um, if I'm correct. So, it, you know, there's just like there's there's factors behind that shoe, you know, the unique emblem, unique box, where it's just like, you know, sleep now, but you can't later. You know what I mean? That's just kind of how it is. So. Also, uh, you know, kind of diving back into the needlework dunk low again, June 1st, 11 a.m. Eastern time, $120 retail. Keep in mind after tax and shipping, if you have, ta um, well, shipping is free usually, but if you have tax in your state, um, then these aren't going to be $120 retail. These are going to be like $128, $129 after like tax, uh, maybe even up to $130, but I think that most I got charged for like a needlework back on the original drop was like $128.7. That's my state tax though. I'm down here in North Carolina, so I know if you're in California, that's going to be, um, you know, a lot different. You'll probably get charged more than me uh, for your pairs just based off the state tax but again the main thing i want to mention about this pair so firstly super clean pair definitely a sleeper every time like if, you, if you're patient these are going to be good because this is this was never a release that was a major stock in the first place i just want to say the first drop for these never really had a lot of pairs and don't expect this one to have a lot of pairs either the main thing i think this release is to be honest my personal thoughts what i think the needleworks would be i think this drop is just going to be the canceled pairs whatever pairs um, or, you know, were left over uh, from the first restock that got sent back that they, you know, just didn't, uh, you know, release with them. That's what I think this will be. I don't think that this particular drop here uh, is going to be, you know, some sort of like high stock cookout. I don't expect more stock than the first release. I'm actually expecting around like 5,000 pairs, maybe even less for this drop right here. So I don't expect massive stock. And the main reason for that is because, again, it's probably just canceled pairs. They loaded this one up quickly, not like the Fuchsias where they, they've loaded that one up like two, three weeks in advance. And you're like, oh, okay, that's probably canceled pairs, um, you know, but th this is completely different. So hopefully y'all understand uh, where I'm getting at. And hopefully that all makes sense for you guys, because I don't think this is going to be just it, the first one wasn't high stock. This one loaded up quickly. I don't think it's like newly produced stock. Hopefully that's, uh, you know, understandable because that's just what I'm thinking for this one. I'm not thinking, you know, we're going to see anything uh, that's really too crazy. But the main thing that kind of makes this dunk low stand out a bit would be, again, you got this unique portion by the heel. You have the unique insoles. Also, I believe the tongue tag and laces are different. Very similar to the Flash Streetwear laces. Uh, maybe you can see where I'm getting at. So there's like a picture. Yeah, here you go. You can see kind of similar uh, to the laces that are on the Flash Streetwear SBs. But 
again, more or less just want to make sure you guys are in the loop. This is on the Nike app, by the way, not sneakers. I just want to make sure people are aware of this. This is not loaded on sneakers. Uh, and you actually have to look up the SKU on the Nike app in order to find that. So here is what you'd have to look up. You'd have to look up this right here, FJ4553-133. That is exactly what you'd be looking up right there in order to find the sneaker. Just search that on the Nike app. Because if you look up Needlework Dunk Low or Dunk Low, I don't think it comes up. Uh, because again, Nike's trying to keep this a little bit more low key, but also I don't think there's as many pairs, so they're not really promoting it on like their front page. Like, hey, we're restocking these. Like, no, they loaded these yesterday, like two days before the drop. So my theory is canceled pairs, low stock, low time, uh, low amount of time to prepare. And the reason for that is because Nike is just, you know, again, trying to keep it a little bit more low key, but also for the simple fact uh, that, you know, it's just, it's not major stock. The first restock wasn't, why would this one, you know, be more stock than the first one? You know what I mean? Uh, or not the first restock, but the first drop, you know, it was like 25,000 or 23,000 pairs. Uh, so, you know, I just, I don't see why this one, um, you know, would be more if that makes sense, unless, you know, they're just, you know, consistently going to restock these, or, you know, maybe they do a second drop with more. It just wouldn't really make sense to me. So again, probably low stock, but again, looking at the resale prices for these right now, for those of y'all that are curious, bigger sizes go for more. It's as simple as that. So the bigger size you get, the more you're going to make on the sneaker. However, the bigger sizes are going to be the ones with less stock. The ones with the most stock are going to be like 7W through 9W. These are going to be the ones with the most stock and also a good hold over time. Those tend to be the sizes that do well with dunks uh, down the line, especially with women's ones, because again, they're the more popular sizes to wear for my ladies. Uh, that's like a five and a half to seven wine grade school. And you know that range is golden whenever you're holding grade school. So that's more or less what I'm trying to get at right here. Don't sleep. So aside from that, that's what we have coming up. June 1st, 11 a.m. Eastern time, not 10 a.m., 11 a.m. So set that reminder because it, it, it's going to trick. I know it's going to trick us. So set a reminder on your phone. Just be like, hey, Siri. And then, you know, let her know what you need to, you know, say. Oh, I just said that. And now my, com yeah, my computer's hearing me. I'm good there. I don't need you, Siri. Um, but yeah, basically, that's important. Just set that reminder because it's not 10 a.m. It's 11 a.m. It's going to, you know, trip us out a little bit because it's not our typical drop time. So if y'all want more content like this, again, feel free to check my Instagrams, any of that down below. And of course, check us out at Hype Lab. Stop sleeping, guys. You can start hitting more with the team. We really cooked the lost and found drop back. Uh, now thinking about it in November, and you can see our testimonials here. And we've been continuing to cook, of course. You can see our recent reviews from this week, uh, the under market deals that we do every single day to keep you guys cooking, sourcing Paris fuel. Uh, so that's another feature we offer within our group. And of course, our back doors, one on one support all of that it is an all-inclusive group and you know it is affordable for you guys that are trying to learn how to become a better reseller so i hope to see you guys there you can get in the waitlist right there you won't be charged until you're let in keep that in mind it does not cost to join the waitlist waitlist is free to join only costs once you're in the group so hopefully that makes sense but that's it uh yeah and that's everything you guys need to know about the needlework dunk lows coming tomorrow so i hope to see you guys down below don't miss out on your chance to become a better reseller and let me know your thoughts on this restock coming tomorrow gonna be hard to get um but you know low stock that's just how they do it sometimes so i'm ending it i'm tristan thank you guys and catch you on the next video soon peace